Hey guys, name's Ven playing some The Dark Mod Contest Vertical. This is called Mad's Mountain by Jesps. A gang of thieves recently stole a painting from the builders. My client, a collector, wants that painting for his personal collection. The gang's hideout is in some caves in a mountain outside of town. The painting can probably be found on the upper levels, along with some of the more important members of the gang, including their leader, Bryce the Mad. Little is known about this Bryce, but he is said to be ruthless to his victims and gang members. Anyway, I doubt he got his nickname for nothing, so I should be careful. Okay. Do not kill anyone? Mm, I guess I'll go for that. Seems like the worst idea in history, so I'll buy a rope arrow or two instead. <laughs> Alright, what do I have actually? Compass, good, lantern, spyglass, short sword, blackjack, water. Okay, all the basics. Excellent. Hey, Trixie, you're a magic. Everybody say hey, Trixie. Oh, is this the on? Hey. <laughs> wow, this is a disgusting cave with pimples of light all over it. Ugh. 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 Well, let's see. Do I go up here? Oh, it's a twitching dead guy. He's got an arrow in his nervous system. And there's that light, darkness, 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 light thing. So I guess I got in here by falling down the hole or something? Yeah. Or I can climb up. Which is probably what I'm supposed to do. I'm not 100% sure. Actually. Oh, wait. I don't even need that rope. I'll just climb up here. Great, so, okay, where, where am I, where am I actually supposed to go? Hey guys, name's Fen and I'm already confused. I guess I should go down into the water. As I guess that is like non-progress maybe? Wow, that's long. Wow. That's long. Now pay me! No, <laughs> no, 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 <laughs> well, hey, okay, uh, if I feel like I'm getting into a place, which I think I am. Oh. You're alerted, are you? Well, <laughs> never mind that. I'm going swimming. <laughs> whoa, hey, hey, whoa, hey. Hey. Really? Oh, there we go. Good, I don't want to have to use that no clip, even if it's just to get unstuck. Whoa. Okay. Nice. So, uh, it's a good thing I went swimming. You know, get some equipment. I am now a trained horseman. Okay. It's about time to stop being a horseman, though. All gotten so serious. And here's an armoire underwater, obviously. Um, man, that didn't even, didn't even succeed. Wow. I don't have a breath potion, do I? Don't think so. <sighs> No. Nothing. Okay, let's try that again. It's an armoire. Underwater. A water moir. Whatever I was saying. It's hysterical. Okay, I'm sure. God damn! What? Oh, I hadn't waited for this bubbles to go up yet. Bubbles. Okay. Let's be serious. Okay. Come on, mate. Okay, let's go up for air one more time. Let's, let's, let's. This is a let's play. It is a play that I say let's in a lot. I don't know. Those those mushrooms on the wall are really triggering my disgust reflex. Just, ugh. <laughs> I mean, god damn. Maybe it's just me, but hey. Sometimes weird things happen, so... Let's grab the potions or whatever. It's a, oh, now there's breath potions. Okay, awesome. Hey, that's pretty cool. Just having a little semi-secret thing that's quite the challenge to get into. It has some tension in it. I'm liking stuff already. But now, it's time to go bop a thief on the head. I can't kill, but I can blackjack and... Oh my god, I'm going to take advantage of this god-given right. God and god are clearly two different beings. One of them is a deity, the other is an opera singer, and neither the one shall sleep together evermore. Because they had a big argument and said, well, since we're not sleeping together, I guess you... Oh, your shadow is scary, nude. 
Get off of here. Well, this is the mission that loves putting little light sources of various different kinds all over the friggin' walls. Ah. Uh, my favorite room in a house. So. <laughs> Got you from the side. Even have your key or anything? No? You're just a schoolman. Oh, you're Althalos, so you have a name. Well, your squad is gonna kill you now because you didn't show up early to dinner. Everybody's gotta show up early. It's kind of like Wall Street with their earnings expectations. You, uh, you can't simply match. You have to beat because beating expectations becomes the expectations. And if you're below expectations, by which you mean you're at expectations, you're not. Uh -huh. Yeah. Okay, hey. Ha, ha, ha. Hey, good brother, sir. Art thou going to have a conversation? Or should I brandish my dagger in your face? I think that's a different voice than this, Hamrite, but I keep putting them together in my voice acting auditions and nobody seems to complain, so ha, 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 ha. Wow. You're Fendrel, Fendrel, Fendrel! There's only room for one Fen in this place, mate, and it's me. Also, your skinniness is symptomatic of your skooma abuse. <laughs> so just <laughs> get the heck out of here. I mean, yeah, I should probably actually just put this fire out of here. I don't know. If it is indeed a fire. Looks pretty low to well, be a fire. Or I could just knock that guy out. I mean, you know, I, I wouldn't use a resource if I were to do that. But, but on the other hand, putting out the fire makes me look cooler. Because, you know, fire right, produces let's heat. Finish this. And, uh, you know, Ugh. no fire, less heat, cooler. You know, I'm oh, sure everybody knows how this works. Hey, he put his sword away. Oh, he put his sword away to run. That's realistic. All right, you know what? You go out too. Because, seriously, I am trying to read this note in the dark with no flashlight. It's the rebellious thing for any eight-year-old style fen to do underneath the bureau whilst playing hide-and-seek. Or thinking he is, anyway. I'm sure no adults wish to play some trivial game of hide-and-seek with the kids. They've got money to make and taxes to do and all sorts of boring, awful shit that they're obviously doing to their kids on purpose. Fendrel, this font sucks. Bring a new chair up to brush! Be, uh, he broke another one, but don't mention anything about it to him. You don't want to end up like the last guy, Donald. Bring a new chair up to Bryce, he broke another one. Don't mention anything. <laughs> well, if he's the one that broke it, why shouldn't you mention anything? Hmm. Is that wood? Looks like metal pipes to me, but what do I know? Obviously, I have learned that swimming is the thing that you should go. But wait. But wait. But wait, there's a secret- oh, it is just secret gold. S secret oh, it's an entire stash, including a bedtime book. <laughs> That's pretty funny, actually. Unfortunately, I don't know what the hell the bedtime book says. Hmm. More demonstration of crate physics in the water? Excellent! Crate physics need more representation in today's parliament. Probably. Parliament, even. Wait a minute, is this just- No. It isn't just. It's not fair in any way. We need a new system with pretty-faced politicians. Which I guess we've gotten, so hey, no problem. Why, uh, there's gotta be something in here, right? One would imagine? Wait a minute. Oh. Oh. Man, I like this. It's like this subtle, climby thing where you can climb subtly, but this almost, this almost looks like progress. I'm gonna, you know, once again just kind of go forward a little bit, and if it starts looking too much like progress, I'll go back and see about the other stuff. Uh-oh. Okay, I d yeah. Yeah, I think that, well, maybe, you know, maybe it's just alternate ways. I'm liking this already, though. Oh, yeah, wow. It's one of those weird missions where you get a loadout store, but then you just get armed to the teeth in the mission anyway. So, I think... Yeah? Huh. Is... It actually almost looks like a dead end. Maybe. No, okay, this is definitely progress, so I'm gonna go and check out- wait a minute though, wait a minute. 
Wait a minute. Let's eat a steak in celebration, but I can't even do it. I guess I'll read this first, though. I don't know. Hmm. Uh, day one. Finally uh, saw me chance to snatch Timmy's purse, and it was full of coins. Walter got some of them rope arrows. We need them to get out Bryce's cave when we grab that painting. Day two. Some old bugger made it in here today. Walter gave him a knock on the head, and he fell right down on the fire. He smells just like roasted boar. We ran out of food a few days ago. I'm so hungry. Day three. Walter suggested eating the old guy, but can we really do that? We don't have any food, and I'm starving. Day four. We need to get out of here, but Bryce has posted guards all over the caves like he's waiting for something. There's only one source of food. The guy we killed. He actually didn't taste bad. Not good, but not bad either. Walter seems to take it quite bad. His face turned green with the first bite and he's thrown up a lot. Day five. There's no more meat left on the old guy and I'm still hungry. Day six. I killed Walter. He woke up while I was biting on his fingers. I didn't mean to kill him, just to see what he tasted like. But he started screaming, and I had to hit him with a rock before he alerted someone. <laughs> what? Day 7. Walter tasted different than the old guy. More bitter. Some parsley would have been... <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> Day 8. I'm almost out of food again. Hopefully someone finds their way down here soon. That's hilarious. Why is... Why are these guys going hungry? Is this guy not feeding his men? Horrible. Alright, well, I guess they just dump the skeletons down the water hole. You know, it's not a very forward-thinking thing, you know? You're gonna need to drink as well as eat. Did you know? It's true. It's crazy, you might say, but... You know, a lot of true things are crazy, and a lot of crazy things are just even more crazy. <sighs> yes, there we go. Moss arrows appear to be higher in the hierarchy. That's why it's called a hierarchy, not a lower archy. Oh, burn, I guess. Then, uh, rope arrows, which is different from thief. I don't know why they sort of arbitrarily did that. <sighs> Perhaps they felt thief was wrong. I don't know. But, uh... Yeah, I have. Hmm. What is that? A little handle or something? Oh, it's a pickaxe, so it is the handle of a pickaxe. Yeah, so I guess... I guess these are different ways up. Oh, jeez, I thought that was a spider for a second. Hey, I really, really am liking this. Like, right off the bat, it gives you a friggin' home run right up in your face's outfield. So... Oh, wait, is this... Yeah, okay, good. So now we're now we're matching right on up here. Excellent, so it is an alternate way. Okay, that's cool. How many times can I state that something's cool before it starts beginning to become a bit of a cliche? I don't know. And neither do you. Wait a minute. Oh. I love this. It forces me to look up. Every time I have to look up, I'm just like, what do I do now? And then I remember. Look up. It's the motto of Whoa! -ho. Jesus Christ. The motto of the Fen proposition. Is looking up. And the Fen proposition is, of course, the uh, name of my new ginormous SUV, which I've bought because I'm rich and, like, don't want to look like a douchebag. Obviously. If I wanted an SUV, I'd buy a Model X. If I wanted a Model X, I'd be a kind of guy who likes SUVs and. Pfft. Okay. So there's stuff to be watched out for here. Grab the damn rope, for God's sake. There. I had to make noise while doing it. Which is not the greatest thing ever, but... I have to be dealt with. Woof. Sir, perhaps you could be eaten by that dude down there. Nice hat. Did and something... ponytail stub, by the way. <clears throat> I guess. I don't know. I mean, that's a pretty nice hat and ponytail stub. This guy looks like that, uh... That City 17 guy from Concerned Citizen, Gordon Froman, from Half-Life 2. You know what I'm talking about, kind of. I mean, he's wearing a toque. Let's eat some bread in celebration. I'm not gonna drink the health potion in celebration, though. That's that's just unholy. No, no, don't want that up in your confession week, do ya? Because everybody know that <sighs> confession week is a-coming, and bad little children are gonna be forced to, uh, you know, feel guilty, which is just the, the, the treatingest way to treat your young'uns. It's very healthy. What are you even talking about? Whoa, I like this. 
I like this stare. I can't take my eye off this stare. My eye, you know, because I have only got one eye. I know it looks like I have two in those videos where it shows me, but I actually don't with no explanation whatsoever. Okay, so up more, I guess. <laughs> I don't know why I keep thinking. I don't know why it is I never look up. I only look down. I mean, I guess gravity pulls me down and I'm thinking, hey, I'm going to fall down. I mean, up is like a weird way to go in intuitive terms from what we're used to for real life. Maybe that's it. You know what I mean? Cause, uh, cause here's a ditch for no reason. Cause, uh, you know, normally we don't climb up ropes and ladders that frequently as compared to like other stuff such as stairs or, or flat ground or holes in the ground. No flash bombs. I'm not allowed to kill nobody. So steal the painting, so, and get the loot. So pretty much, it's just a simple little snatch and grab job. Excellent. Alrighty. Let's not be fuelish. If I wanted to be fuelish, I would be humming coming at ya. Getcha, you, gotcha, you, gotcha, shoot ya, deaded you, shoving skooma in your face. <laughs> I don't know. That guy, he just... He's a skooma guy because those guys in Oblivion, sometimes those cat people have hoods, I think. And for some reason, he looks like one. I, I don't really know why. And also, there's one in the skooma den who has this horrifying thing when he drinks. They can't make the mouth make an O shape, so it's just like this polygon smashing that just is absolutely terrifying. Okay, but like, seriously, dude, like, what is... what is your deal? I mean, there's a light there, so I think even if I were to put this crap out, I don't think that would do me much good. You look like you're the kind of dude who would turn around. I mean, but what do I know? Perhaps there's a different way. I mean, like, I just went in the water, right? Is there even anything? I, I gotta go up. Okay, I can, there is no passage through the water, right? Because... Why is this... friggin' thing here? Well, I guess I'll... This isn't gonna work. There's a light right there. I mean, it flickers sometimes, sure. But... That's all. Health. I mean, I could run away from him, of course. But... Oh, no. Okay, so is there anything behind you just like scouting time? There's a ladder. This is probably another alternate way up, then. Yeah. Okay, of course, you know, there I am. I'm, I didn't look up, but I mean, to be fair, that looks like the passage that you go. I mean, I guess this is some sort of psychoanalysis of me. You know, my, my personality is that of wanting to just stay on the beaten path all the freaking time. But I mean, who, who doesn't? Also, who? You know, just to imitate an owl. It has nothing to do with anything, but if I were to imitate an owl, that is probably what I would say. Yeah, because here we are up here. Okay, well, at least I didn't take absolutely forever about it, so, uh, hey, you can't rag on me too much. Should probably stop saying that. Ulrich. Also, I have an excuse to knock everybody out, because I wish to read their names. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Also, oh, ho, 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 ho. Also, this is a ladder, so that's kind of the worst. I can also knock you out. You probably have a name called Secret Easter Eggman Suit. That's your name. Super Easter Eggman Suit. Or Secret Easter Eggman Suit, you know, as as a nickname for short. It's Hadrian. <clears throat> Hadrian Smith. You'll be composing riffs in the afterworld now. <laughs> and he slides all the way down because good physics. Well... Never mind that, I guess he can... It doesn't seem like a good idea to me, though. Whatever. Good enough. Can I grab this other light, and then I'll have two lanterns, you know, dual wheeling lanterns? No. Disappointing? Well... Here we are at the, uh... Red door, so I think I'm gonna leave it here, so next time... Uh... I'll go in the red door. See you guys then, and bye for now.